I'm not sure if I'm gonna get late for this class. If I do, consider me the luckiest person you've ever come across. If I don't, bro, I'm gonna have to get a repeat, of which I'm not ready for. I don't know if you have these lecturers who usually want to meet everyone on their off days. Cause tell me why it's Thursday and she's telling us, I want to see you guys on Thursdays. And I usually have classes Monday through Wednesday. So it sucks, but it's cool. Tell me why it's 10.30 right now. I used two hours to get to school. And the lecturer said the meeting should be at 11. At 11, it only means one thing. I'm one and a half hours late. Negative. But at the end of the day, I'm still skeptical about the whole meeting. I'll tell you why in a minute. Hola. Hey there. Good morning. <laughs> Your first time seeing this face right now. Don't panic. I'm Sti. I'm gonna take you through the entire day of my life at school. Which by the way, I don't know if I'm gonna get kicked out of that class. So let's go. Let's just leave. Let me, let me, let me, let me. I got a ride. I got a ride. Getting a ride and then arriving here one minute later, no cars, no cars. I'm gonna have to wait for like I don't know five minutes or so or three. Let's just be hopeful. You know what's confusing me the most? It's the weather. Five minutes we are sunny, five minutes we are cloudy. I don't know. I can't carry an umbrella. So if it's gonna rain, it's a bad day. It's a bad day. At this point, the lecturer has already texted me twice. Where are you? Where are you? It's already 11:10. Tell you're not ready you know why you're not because <laughs> you didn't know i take two cars to school so i'm headed to my next lecture have an idea of what i'm gonna do or what i'm gonna tell that lecturer i'm gonna show her this footage and tell her you know what i know you won't believe but i come from far it took two hours because of this and this and that she's gonna see how much i struggled to get to school honestly that's the only excuse i'm gonna have she'll be like why didn't you then wake up early and then start your journey two hours ago or two hours before time and i'll be like you texted us at night saying we should meet at 11. how did you expect me to say that rude <laughs> I'm here, but do you remember me telling you I was so skeptical about this particular meeting at school? You look at what's happening right now. That's right, our teachers have decided to strike again. I mean, this vlog, I was supposed to record it yesterday, which I did, I took you along with me. I got to the, the moment I got to school, it was just okay, so chaotic. This lecturer, this particular lecturer wants to meet us today. She's already met half of the group. Yeah, let me get in here and see what's gonna happen to me. I don't know. I don't know what's my fit. I never even took 10 minutes. I never took more than 5 minutes, bro. This is what I rushed here for. And she was very confident with my work. Let me take you through what I'm doing. It's a project, of course. That's why we had a meeting. But she was seeing everyone individually. That's why she had to text me where are you. It's interesting, I saw it's a research project on YouTube content and how it affects college students, bro. She just read my introduction and she told me, you're good, you can go, you can go. I mean, she's already tired, students can't keep time anymore. The strikes are going, but I understand her. She just read my introduction. At this point, the only worry that I have is what I'm gonna eat or drink. Oh, oh and think about my friends who are on site, if they even bother to come with this strike going well.
I don't want to sit here and pretend it's all fine because it's not. First off, I had this for lunch. Only, only. I didn't have time to pack my lunch. I couldn't even find a dish. Second, it's about to rain. I did not carry an umbrella. Because at this point, it's hunger and rain that's bothering me. Bye-bye. Thank you for tuning in.